Hi guys, what is going on? It's Dice 1090 here, and today I've got probably the most overpowered glitch possible in multiplayer at the moment. So what this glitch allows you to do is have an infinite ripper. So with this infinite ripper, you'll be able to just run around the map, even if you die, you'll respawn with your ripper, and you can just constantly use it over and over again, which is great for maps such as Nuketown Combine. It'll be useful on pretty much any, but on Nuketown and Combine, you can just absolutely destroy. So now we're going to jump into a tutorial on how to do it. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to be just on the main menu of multiplayer. You want to go over to your chill person, go onto combat record and go into campaign. On your campaign, click on your weapons and then scroll all the way to the bottom. Once you've done this, you just want to press B, go onto your equipment and then scroll all the way to the bottom again, just as you did with the weapons. Then finally, go B again and go on cybernetic combat and scroll all the way to the bottom. So once you've done this, you want to go to your purifier gear, which means you will have to be level 46 at least, so actually have unlocked it. Um, you'll have to go into your specialist, go over to your purifier, press Y on him, and then go down to showcase weapon. Click on your showcase weapon, go over to secondaries, and there should be something called a war machine. It'll look like the M27 on Black Ops 2. So you just want to click on it and it'll place it on your character. As you can see, it's sort of a glitch weapon, it's got no mag in it. But yeah, it'll probably hold it quite weirdly. But you have then successfully done this part. So once you've done that, you want to go back, you want to go to create a class. You want to go to your very bottom create a class. Um, but you need to at least press these once, so it needs to be your create a class either 6 to 10. Go on your bottom one, click on your secondary, click on war machine. And as you can see, it'll put a heat wave in place of an actual secondary. Then you want to make sure you have some sort of lethal. I just take a Semtex, but that doesn't really matter. And it also helps if you have the perk one perk of overclock, because this will allow you to earn your specialist faster. So now we're just going to jump into a game and I will join you guys there. Okay hey guys, so as you can see, I've joined into a stronghold domination. So what you want to do is just as you spawn in, just choose the class which has the heat wave on it. And now you pretty much just want to play until you've earned your ripper. After you've earned your ripper, you just got to play a little bit more and then it'll tell you you've earned your heat wave. From here, you can just use your Ripper infinitely, um, it'll last for the whole round, or if you're playing on something like Hardpoint, it'll last for the rest of the game. And then, yeah, you go, you've basically completed the glitch, and this is a really, really simple glitch to do. If you guys do have any difficulties, then make sure to ask in the comments. But other than that, I'll see you guys in the next video.